in this locker we found a bunch of stuff signed and uh, such. It might be a vintage shirt, Yahoo shirt. Pretty cool. Okay. Oh, hey there. Wait, what's up, locker notes? <laughs> oh, what's this? Whoa. Oh, what is this? Oh, this looks like a drawer box, guys. Come on. That's from the San Francisco Mu Museum of Modern Art. What is this? What is this for? Nice stuff. Look at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? Michael Kors belt, very nice. What's this? Heat tool. Oh, an embossing heat tool. That's nice. That's cool, right? Oh, whoa, nice. Oh, wait, 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 can't show that one. Okay, there is a ton of onesies in here. Oh, brand new stuff here. It's 20 bucks. Super cool looking little tin. Nice looking sewing machine right here. Oh, how cool. What's up, Locker Nuts? Okay, you know what's great about like buying a storage locker, bringing it to my personal storage, and going through it at my pace? Because any old day where I have a couple, a few minutes, maybe half an hour, maybe an hour, to go through stuff, I could just do it. It's so fun. I was garage sailing this morning. I had to swing by my locker to pick up some items to go into our live auction on Monday. And I thought, you know what? I think we got like 10 boxes over here from, that, uh, from the guy that moved to Hawaii. So let's go through them. Are you guys ready? Let's have some fun. All right, guys, we got our table set. We got some boxes. We got a Stockton box there. We got a, I don't know, a better flea market or live auction. I don't know, stuff to go through a second time later. Got it ready to go. This is what we got right here. Just this box is here. I have some stuff in one of my other units. So there'll be more to go through than just this. Oh, I see some stuff back here. I don't know what, I don't remember why I put that aside. But anyways, um, yeah, this has got to be like part six or seven going through this locker. There's a lot of stuff. Joy to the world. I don't know. This is the arts and crafts stuff. The lady was a crafter. We found some really nice crafting stuff. That's what this appears to be. Uh, yeah, but specifically Christmas. There's a little ornament. Ooh, it's got some nibble nibble on it. Hmm, huh. that's interesting it got nibbled on. Because, uh, rats did get into this locker, unfortunately, but not in this box, right? That's pretty funny. That's cute. Look at that. Oh. That plugs in the USB somehow. These are, I think, all little fiber optics. We'll have to plug that in and see what it does. I'm curious. Crafts. Little stocking. Feels like it's something in there. In there. Wait. Oh, I just pulled that off. Dang it. I don't think that was supposed to happen. I think it's just decorative. Eh, that one fell off too. What's going on here? Nice stocking. Stockings. Stockings. It really feels like there's something in there. Must just be fabric. Okay, and speaking of fabric, there's some fabric. Oh, that you know what that is? Well, that's a rat poop right there. Gross. Dang it. But this, I think, is to go underneath the tree, right? That's to go underneath the tree, I think. I don't know. Whatever. Oh, wait. What's that? Countdown to Christmas. Little Charlie Brown. Uh, it's a little ideas for crafts. Learn how Christmas is celebrated in other countries. Send a card to a friend. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, whatever. Okay, next box says arts and crafts. Tees, quilt kit, and fleece. It says fleece, not fleas. Fleece. Quilted Angel, look at that, so it's shop for quilting. Funny, I just went to an estate sale this morning uh, that was selling quilting stuff. That's what that is, this little quilting squares. That's actually kind of nice, kind of nice. Let's see how much that was. Mm, that's a bookstore. Quilted Angel, I don't know, 24 bucks. Yeah, a whole bunch more quilting squares right here. Right? I think that's what this is. It's all kinds of fabric and stuff. I don't know. I don't know. It's just scraps of fabric. I think it's for quilting. I really don't know. That's a stick. <laughs> that's a straight up stick. Frosty and Friends Wall Quilt Kit. Oh, that's cool. There's another one. Sue and Sam Wall Quilt Kit. Mm -hmm. What's in the bag? Sewing stuff. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, what's this? Paint bucket. It contains 110 yards knit picks. Flower, dried flowers? Hmm. Yeah, that's the dried flowers. Knitting stuff, okay. I don't know. I don't know. All right, here's some fabric. Some more kid stuff, baby stuff. More fabric. More fabric. Austin Owl Kit. 
Oh, and then here's some. Wait, that's say t shirts, didn't it? Tees. Yeah, okay. That's cool. Okay, we like t shirts. We like t shirts. Let's get this out. This could be good, guys. Vintage shirts are pretty uh, desirable. If you guys watch our flea market videos, especially the good flea market, the De Anza one, this is uh, little kid stuff here. Kids clothing, not quite as much. Even if it's vintage, doesn't really get people all excited or nothing. It's just stuff. Okay. All right. That's cool. Yeah, if you watch the De our De Anza flea market videos, uh, the t-shirts are the first to go. Okay, old 97s right there. That's that group. In this locker, we found a bunch of stuff signed and such from, from this very group. So I think that's a little better. I'm going to put that aside in our second pass box. Look at this shirt right here. Yahoo. Big web surfer. Um, that's pretty interesting, right? Yahoo. Uh, that might be a vintage shirt. Oh, oh, single stitch Yahoo shirt. Pretty cool. Um, big web surfer suggests it's vintage, I think, because Yahoo started out as a, a web browser, didn't it? Or something, I don't know. I'll make two piles of this. One to go to the better flea market, one to just go to the flea market. A flea market, meaning Stockton flea market. Huh. I don't know if that's right, but it says custom made especially for you by housewares. It's a drum set. Heavy rotation. It's kind of cool. I'll put a set. Really looking for the vintage stuff, but the other stuff, if it's cool, it'll probably sell. Whether it does or doesn't, I don't really care. I'm just going to bring it to the market. So if it doesn't sell in Dienza, we'll bring it to Stockton. If it doesn't sell in Stockton, we'll give it away. Problem with Stockton is not only are people super cheap, there just really is not that many customers out there anymore. The ones that go are like, they're either pickers. And they're only going to grab the best stuff, your best stuff. Bobby's World. I think that was Howie Mandel's cartoon. Um, that's kind of neat right there. I'm going to put that better flea market. Um, yeah, they'll either be pickers grabbing your best stuff or they're just like the same guys are out there just wanting stuff for nothing. Which is totally fine because we got stuff for nothing. But uh, it's not what we, you know, we don't make any money doing that. So we're really trying to sell the stuff. Trying to make some money out there. And Marine Corps, that's kind of a nice one uh because it's like a 100 bucks in gas round trip with my trailer so i gotta make a little bit of money plus i i usually hire some guys to help me so i gotta make a little bit of money carbon five i think it's a company or something gilden mm, stockton every flea market that we go to has a purpose that's a neat shirt right there i'm not sure why it's got like maybe a little paint or something on it though yeah, maybe that'll come off it's neat it's a women's shirt though another neat one schroeder san francisco bavarian food <laughs> Hmm, what is that? Magical Vinny Knickers? What? I never heard of that company. I'll put that aside. Premium German beer. Another one of those. Zipcar. All right. T-shirts are kind of cool. All right, next one says Katie's Baby Toys. Okay. Oh, hey, there. Wait, what's up, Lockermans? <laughs> uh, these guys had some nice stuff, and especially like their kid toys and stuff is definitely a little better quality. Nice quality. Ooh. I wonder if our granddaughter would play with that for a few minutes. I don't know. Hmm. Let's go on a picnic. <laughs> this one plate is yellow rose. Okay. All right, so we're not going on a picnic. She said bye. Oh, this is a good one right here. That's a good one. Right? Like this? Yes, look it. Locking us so smart. <laughs> That's actually a good tool. Teach them shapes and such. And tractors. Oops. Oops. Melissa and Doug right here. That's cool. That's good stuff. Hmm. What does this thing do? Okay. Oh, okay. Alright. Whatever. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. I mean, if I go straight to the market with this, I'm thinking 10 to 20 bucks for this box. 10 to 20, all right? Keep in mind, we go to some pretty cheap flea markets, but uh, I don't know. Should I let Jana do a pass on that? It'd be so much easier if Jana was here. You could just say yes or no. Most of the time it's no, but every once in the blue moon, it might be a yes. I think I'll put it aside. I'm going to regret that later. Should just let it go. Okay, what is this? this one didn't say anything. So what do we got? Uh, okay, first up we got some tissue paper. That's good. It's good because we use a lot of tissue paper when we ship. There's a coffee mug. Sticky notes. Ooh, Tiffany & Company envelope. I like that. I like it a lot. 
Hmm, catalog. Nice, nice, nice. Snow babies, Christmas cards. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Whoa. This box is looking a little better. Not to say it wasn't looking good, but it's looking better. Oh, what is this? Oh, this looks like a jewelry box, guys. Come on. Boo. 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 No jewelry in the jewelry box. It's from Bloomingdale's, whatever it was originally. Yeah. It's a nice little box, though. Okay. There's another chance for romance right here. Oh, wait. Kate Spade. I think we found some other Kate Spade stuff. That's not Kate Spade. Someone's head right there. Um, what do we find from Kate Spade? I think we found rings, right? We found rings. Okay, there's some... Oh, that's cool. Oh, look at how cool. That's San Francisco Bay Area. That's where we live. Map of the country. $17. That's from the San Francisco Mu Museum of Modern Art. Happy Holidays. San Francisco Christmas. That's cool. Cards are good for us. We do have buyers for cards, believe it or not. Crochet to go. That's a sealed pack right there of something. Hmm. New and approved year. 16 bucks again, Museum of Modern Art. I guess that is, huh, I don't know. Those are cards of some sort. More cards, looks like they like these ones because they're almost gone. There's only one, oh, there's a couple. Those are cool. Sugar, <laughs> it says sugar. It's all sugar stuff, cookies, treats, sweets. Empty bag. Okay, here's another one, look at that. That one's sealed, this one's not, so we can see what it is. What is it, like flashcards for crocheting? Yeah, I mean, kind of, right? It's, huh. Interesting. Scarves. Okay. Cool. $3.95 for this little card. Birthday greetings. Super cool though. Super cool. Um, and like I was saying before, we do have buyers for cards. So I just like to make big lots of them, but we do sell them in our live auctions. Pom Pom Pals book and craft set or craft kit. That looks new, doesn't it? That's cool. Okay, what we got here? A little sewing stuff. Cork. Bride to be. Button. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, Maui Divers Jewelry. Come on. Ooh, 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 what do we got? Okay, just a pearl. One pearl. That's cool. Whatever. I'll take it. I'm happy. Doesn't take much to make me happy. And this right here, the ring. Hmm? We'll sell it. That's a donut keychain right there. Oh, he's got eyes. I don't know what that is. Is it, what is that? Scarf? It's like the wood beads right here. I don't know. Whoa, some of these losing their feathers in here. A little bit of ribbon. Oh, birdie. I think that's made from a real birdie, but I think he's done. I think he's done. He's making a mess. It's too bad. He's kind of cool. Dang it, there's two of them. Flower? I think that's for a gift wrap, you know? Wow, there's lots of little birdies in here, but they're all losing their feathers. I just don't want to mess with them. <laughs> Bride to be, groom to be. Design bill. Got some buttons. Talk slow, thinks fast. Nice little basket. <laughs> Look at that. These are such nice cards. $3.95. I'm all steamed up over you, Valentine. Please radiate a little love. So cute. Look at that. Little coin bag or pencil bag. Brand new. $5. Okay. Happy holidays. Season's greetings from San Francisco. More cards. Oh, there's more cards. Same ones. Love it. There's another card. Valentine for my honey. Another $3.75 back in the day. Giddy. This little pink bag right there. Oh, there's some nice stationery again. Look at this. Notepads. Three pad set from Anna Griffin. Plus six dollars on sale. More tissue paper. I say we use that for packing, but also Jana uses it for gifts, so we might make it to our gift section in a bar garage. Uh, the pastel kit. That's good right here. Some pastels. It's got some weight to it too. That was $23 right here, guys. This is, I love finding art stuff. This is a really good find also. Nice little clipboard right there. Petite collage garlands. Oh, that's really cool. Look at that. It's got a couple of animals and it's got letters so you can string them up to make it say whatever you want. Create your own party greeting. Very cool. Tumbling down, All right? More snow babies. That's a different print than the other ones though, but still cool. What are these for? I'm not sure. All right, that's it for that box. Next box. And if there's a chance that you guys just joined us, this is your first ever Lock and Us video. Uh, this is my 12 by 30 storage locker. Most of this whole side right here, this is our train locker. This is the, we bought two. This is the second one. We still have not gone through any of these boxes. I mean, maybe we peeked in a couple of these, just peeked in those totes, not up here though. This we still have to go through, all right? Got a lot of stuff to go through and it's probably pretty expensive trains in there. 
this is all gone through but right now i've because this locker had some space and i needed some pl some place to put all this stuff that i brought back uh that's what we're using it for there's a little bubble wrap right there that's kind of funny it's three dollars in bubble wrap it's like my goodness that don't get me very far i use a lot of bubble wrap because we ship a lot of stuff we sell a lot of stuff there's some baby gift bags right there happy birthday okay so it smells good in here so it smells dang good in here mm-hmm that's what it is right there. Ooh, that's some nice soap. Lavender geranium handmade soap. Heck yeah. I love finding nice soap. I, I don't really like spending my big money on soap. <laughs> soap can be expensive. I think I spent like 20 bucks on a bar of soap before. Uh, yeah. Whole Foods right there. That's some nice soap. And here's some more nice soap. Dang, more Whole Foods. They're not like this one. This is the one that smells really good. These probably are fine. Good stuff. More tissue paper. Another gift bag. What is this? What is this for? What is this for? What is this? Is this a travel pillow? What is? What the heck, you guys? I've never seen one of these before. Is this a travel pillow? Is that why it's like that? Rolled up. Tempur-Pedic. Man, that's some nice stuff, too. Nice stuff. That's a nice little pillow right here, if that's what that is. Oh, oh can I get it back in? Hmm. If you guys know what these are for, let me know. I know what tempur is, obviously, but just that little piece. Is that just for traveling, or is that for, like, the car or something? We got two of them. Oh, geez, that scared me right there. I gotta reel that in a little bit. That has nothing to be scared of, but it's just, it just caught me off guard, you know what I'm saying? What is this? Let's see, that hangs. Oh, I think it's for luggage. I think that clips into luggage, and that's to hook another bag on your luggage. Nice Ziploc there. That gross bugs gotta come out. Crazy maze. Oh, how funny. I only say it's funny because we found so many of those kinds of puzzles and mazes in the estate lockers that we bought recently. I've got oodles of them. There's a bunch more. It looks like uh, vacuum bags or something. Oh, boy, a bunch of them. Yeah, what's this? Okay, it's a garment bag. Ben Sherman's British Soul. That's a nice bag. Look at... Oh! What the... Look at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? Is this, I guess it's foreign currency. Just trying to figure, oh, what a cool little pouch right here. Super cool. But uh, look at this, you guys. A whole bunch of foreign currency. Is this real? Polynesian Francais, Republic Francais. It doesn't feel real. Is that a real coin? I, this one feels real. Huh. Sweet. God, look at all that. Whole bunch of foreign currency. I like that. I love the pouch too. This is a sea line. Oh, okay. Waterproof bag. Very nice. Very nice. What is this for? Uno H2O. Oh, oh. This is a card game that you can play in the water? It's kind of stuck together a little bit. Let's get them separated. But now, how do you do that? How do you play that? Oh, oh, oh. You unclip it. Okay. But they're plastic cards, so they won't, uh, they won't get ruined with water. Super cool. What's this? This is fun, isn't it? I mean, I hope you guys are liking this. Light gear. Light gear. How does this work? Needs a battery, first of all. Um, this could be something cheap, nothing, or it could be something for like diving or something. It could be more expensive. We'll have to look this up later. A little piece or something. Earplugs? Yeah, earplugs. Max earplugs. This look like nice ones. All right. This is a fun little box. I like the soap the best. All right, next box. Mmm, okay. Photos, 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 photo, photos. Yep, 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 yep. Got photos. Okay, photos. Oh, I hope this isn't all photos. It's not all photos. All photos. Photos. Because this was a private party deal, um, I'm getting the photos back to them. So we're making a nice little stack over here. It's actually kind of a large stack. Uh, the deal with this locker, if you guys didn't see the earlier videos, is uh, a gentleman uh, watched one of our videos, actually. The video that I made where it talked about selling your own locker on storage treasures, like auctioning off your private locker. There's some bottles. Oh, message in a bottle. Okay, message. It's for putting messages in there. Let's see if they pulled a few out. Crafting stuff, you know. I'll go to Stockton. So he watched that video because he's he moved to Hawaii um, about six years ago. Well, here's some neat stuff. Look at that. That's a really cool little bracelet right there. Not exactly for me. <laughs> I think that's cool though. It's a ladies bracelet. That's what I mean. Michael Kors belt. Very nice. It's definitely got some use on it. Got some scuffing and stuff on here. But Michael Kors, we love Michael Kors, man. And we find the Michael Kors purses. They sell for the big bucks. 
they sell really really well for us uh there's a nice little belt right there j crew okay another belt right there paul frank oh that's cool oh oh nice really nice paul frank belt cool these straps are probably to a bag or something right handbag bridesmaid nope nope it's just some old guy talking to himself in a locker no 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 not a bridesmaid <laughs> all right there's a little lock combo lock and more straps okay we're definitely gonna have to keep these straps because you know what when i go to a locker i always like to be strapped little dad, dad joke there sorry i can't help it it's like i'm programmed to let the da dad jokes go can't hold them back can't hold them back no more so anyways he uh saw the video he's looking at selling it getting rid of this locker because he moved to hawaii he couldn't keep the locker stamping cards all right there's just little cards for st stamping you're like yeah locker nuts really you needed to explain that to us i think we understand that I know. Um, some envelopes. This is a sealed box of envelopes. So, uh, office supplies always sell out the market too. There's some, I don't know, drafting stuff, illustrating, stencils, whatever. More stamping cards. So, um, yeah, he moved to Hawaii and he left this locker behind. And he's like, oh, what am I going to do with this? I don't have time to go back and clean it out. He didn't want the stuff. He's not going to ship it over there because it's super expensive. So, he said, yeah, I'm paying rent for six years on this. I want to get rid of it. So, Fridge frames, that's kind of neat. Brand new. Sealed, right? So uh, he was exploring his options, came across my video, and was like, maybe I should auction it, or maybe I'll reach out to Locker Nuts and see if he wants to just straight up buy it. And that's what I did. We bought it, and it's been a pretty good investment so far. I don't know. It's not like a super huge money, but it's been fun. And we found a couple things that we're going to keep, so that's cool. He definitely had a nice taste. There, his family and him had nice taste. Foam sheets there. Plastic canvas. Canvas. Huh. Okay. It's crafting stuff. I just don't know what it's for exactly. There's a neat little bowl. Look at that. It sits on its side kind of. Glue gun. What's this? Heat tool. Oh, an embossing heat tool. That's nice. It's crafting stuff right there. More stamping cards. Black and Decker. Oh, dust buster. I didn't even know they made dust busters still. I guess they do. That's cool, right? Oh my goodness, still has a charge after six years. Not much of one. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm surprised it has anything, so. That is cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get, even comes with some crackers, too. Some crackers. If you get hungry. Let's see. What am I going to do with it? What am I going to do? I'm walking back and forth. I don't know what to do. It's like I got stumped. I think I need to bring that home and charge it up. I'm going to bring it to the market. It'll work. Okay. Stuff can go to the market. What do we got here? A little hanger. More books. Kids' books, children's books, a bunch of them, little house. Hmm. I'll tell you, we sold a fair amount of books at the market. Not all of them, but we sold a fair amount. I think we were selling them for like two bucks each. So, of course, the nicest ones went, you know, and the other ones didn't. But we made some money. Oh, cute little socks. Zero to six months old. <laughs> little yoga. That's funny. Oh, wow, look at this. Fuzzy yellow ducklings. The fuzzies. Oh, this one's kind of messed up in here. Triangle. That's cool. It's all about uh, textures and, sens uh, what do you call it, sensations. Thomas the train. Yeah. 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 Teeth are not for biting. You little biters. Yeah, that's that. Kitty cat bag. We've got one more thing uh, in this bag right here. Yeah, that's cool. Look at that hat, sun hat. Oh, that's really nice, actually. Sunday Afternoons is the name. It's brand new. Look at that, 36 bucks. Yeah, that's actually really cool. You know, we sold our hats for $5 each at the market because it was a super hot day. So that'll go to the market, and I think we'll sell that. It's a nice one. Your okay, next bin. This one looks kind of interesting, All right? Oh, this is heavy. Huh. Okay. I don't know. It's different parts of the cow. I mean the uh, pig. It's got some of the putty on it like it was stuck to the wall. This is it's great stuff for putting lighter things on the walls. You know, put nails in it. It's kind of a neat piece. I don't know. Let's see what's in here. Oh, whoa. Nice. Look at that. Starbucks. $11 brand new. 2013. This is nine years old. San Diego. That's a beautiful brand new Starbucks cup right there. Okay, that's what this is, huh? I think that is a Starbucks uh, box. Hopefully this is another Starbucks right here. Yep, California. Another brand new Starbucks mug. I love these Starbucks mugs. They do sell. Some of them are worth money. I don't think those are old enough to be the big money, but uh, they're all going to have a little bit of value. Put those aside. 
I just like them though. Oh, that's neat. Look at that. <laughs> that's cool. Baby Gap. Nice bag. Cook County, Texas. Oh boy, note cards. Huh? Is this a note card? Oh, you tear them out. Very cool. There's the envelopes. Nice stuff. High quality. Embroidery stitches. Let me put that with our crafting. This is how I roll. Okay, Crayola. Nice big thing of Crayolas right there. I don't think those are worth that much, but go to the market, we'll sell it. Subversive cross stitch. What? Look at this. 33 designs for your surly side. Uh-oh, we gotta check this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can't show that one. Too bad, so sad. Cro what? Get a life. This place sucks. Is that all there is? Kiss my grits. Mom. Babies suck. Okay. Oh, that was pretty funny. If I was gonna do cross stitch, it'd be one of those. Lucy's. That's it. Yeah. There's some fancy socks for kids. Yahoo! Sports. It's a nice looking hat. Oh, that's nice. Look at this. That's cool too. That's cool too. Mouth yarn. Bamboo knitting needles. Dude, this is some nice stuff right here. This is so soft right here. Baby alpaca. $7.50 for just that. What's this stuff? What's this? I don't know. It's super soft too. It's 13 bucks for that. Dang. Dang. Okay, that's all definitely going to go in a lot. A part of a lot, you know. Crafting a lot in our auctions. You guys probably heard me talking about auctions a couple times now. And if you're new to the channel... Uh, we do live auctions, but only on YouTube, not on Facebook. If you're watching this on Facebook, sorry. You gotta go to our YouTube. Um, what's this? A paper towel with a baby wipe something. That's what it is, baby wipe. Yeah, we're gonna auction off a lot of this stuff. A little better stuff, I should say. The fabric, I'm not sure if we'll auction off the fabric. It's so heavy. I know fabric's expensive. This looks like some nice stuff, too. I like the pattern. Um, a lot of baby stuff in here. Maybe be my maternity bamboo collection. Brand new. Look at all this stuff. Mm, that's just the ribbon to tie up the clothes. Look at this. Brand new socks. Three for 15 bucks. That was five bucks. They're actually kind of cool, aren't they? <laughs> Little baby toys. Little bell. Five dollar bell. What's it called? A tea bell. Tea, please. Nice. Golf ball. Oh, what's in here? <laughs> Nothing. This is a shaker. That's actually pretty cool. It's got a good beat. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Hello Kitty Band-Aids. <laughs> what is this? I think this is a puppet. That is what it is. Are you a puppet? <laughs> Finger puppet. How funny. Okay, there is a ton of onesies in here. Look at that Gerber. 18 months. Wait, 18 months? That's not a onesie, that's a shirt. But this is, uh, huh. I mean, 18 months. They still wear onesies at 18 months. There's 12 months. Little onesie. Anyways, these look clean. They look like they're barely used. I mean, by the time my kids were that age, theirs didn't look like this. They don't, these don't even look used right here. That doesn't even look used. Zero to three months. Oh my goodness. This is actually a good little box. So some uh, young friends of ours, they are expecting their first. So I might put this aside and see if uh, they want them. I don't know. Um, I'll put it aside. I don't want to bring it to the market till I give them a chance. But what else we got in here? This is looks like some more fabric, but it almost feels like uh, sheets, bed sheets. But I think it's fabric. And then baby wipes and some diapers. I'll just bring that to the market. Here's another pair of those funky socks. I love it. Foot traffic. $8. That's three for 15, I think. Some more fabric right here. I mean, that's a shirt. Wait, let's we'll look at that in a second. A couple more golf balls. Oh, brand new stuff here. Brand new stuff here. Another t shirt here. Sean John. Double XL. It's got some blue dye on it, though. And this one also, Sean John. Double XL. Dang. I used to wear double XL. I'd keep it if I was still in that size but i'm not it's a little bib that could be done okay baby be my maternity bamboo collection wait we already found one of those where i put it i don't know and look at this sock monkey and sock elephant doll so you make your own dolls oh that's so cool and these were 13 bucks each there's 26 bucks right there i like it 
Okay, next box, this says upstairs living room. Dang it, it's super heavy. Oh, that one's got some weight to it. Ah, it's books, magazines, crafting stuff. Yay, 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 yay. Backyard horseman. Dang it. Hmm. I say dang it because it's not easy to do what I got to do with this stuff. It's This has to go to a better market. It's, it will not sell if I bring it to Stockton. It just won't. It looks like some decent stuff, right? Cooking, crafting, decent stuff. Hmm. I see a big book down there for Audrey Hepburn. Yeah, I think we're going to have to bring this to the better market. Um, it's just super heavy. Next box is design magazines. Yeah. There's some other stuff too. Look at that birthday party kit. It's 20 bucks. It's cool. Superhero food doodles. Paper dolls. Oh, this is really cool. Flower fairies. Paper dolls. Oh, they never even did these. That is really nice. Okay, flower fairies. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Sparkly stickers, flower fairy tea party. This is nice stuff. What are these? Horizon? March 1959. What is it? I don't know what this is. What is this Horizon? March 1959 by American Horizon. Hmm. What is all this stuff? Horizon. September. Okay. I don't know. Is there any value in that? I have no clue. What's this bad boy? 1969 Terrapin. Is this a yearbook? Because it's stinking huge. I think it is. It's a yearbook. Wow, super huge. Okay, if that's a yearbook, we'll get that back to them because they'll probably want that. That's a military book of some sort. That's pretty neat. And more of these things, these uh, Horizon books. 1958, I have no clue what that is. I've never seen those before. So, what else we got? The Space Planner. <laughs> Everyone poops. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I think I've heard of this book before. Oh, gross. What does whale poop look like? Yeah, I, I want to know that. They have the answers. Some stop to poop, others do it on the move. Oh man, that'd be great if you could do it on the move. Others clean up after themselves. Everyone poops. That's disgusting. It's pretty funny. The Gas We Pass. The Story of Farts. Is this for real? You guys are making some crazy books these days. We don't have books like that. Baroom. Burp, burp, burp. Baroom. Look, he knocks the people over. Heck of funny. Organic Baby. That is a nice looking book right there. This costs some money to produce, that's for sure. Deluxe Book of Flower Fairies. Oh, this is a nice book too. Look at this. Flower Fairies. That goes with the stickers. Doodle All Year. Autographed copy. That's autographed right there. Huh. What the heck? Somebody's really selling those kinds of doodles. It looks like our kids have smoked that. I mean, that would be way better than that. Art and Science of Estiology. Yeah, some kind of... Uh, a Vita Institute. All right, looks like some more books to go to the better flea market. I might pull the flower fairy out to uh, auction that stuff. Okay, next up we got this thing right here. I like I like the way this looks, but there's nothing in it, and it's it's yeah, it's just decorative. Super cool looking little tin briefcase. I don't know, that's five bucks maybe at the market. Just put it aside for now. Let's see what this is right here. Igloo. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is nice. This is a cooler, guys. This is. Oh, I like it already. I'll, oh no, it's not a cooler. Wait, it is a cooler. But it's got a sewing machine in there. Okay. <laughs> it's a cooler, but it's got a sewing machine in it. Okay, it's, uh, that's a neat cooler. Actually, that's a really nice cooler. I love the ones with the little Ziploc top because you don't have to unzip it to get to your drinks. And I use one very much like this, the soft side. I use one in my cars. I kind of transfer it around from car to car. Uh, I think I'm gonna keep that. I think I'm gonna keep it because now I'm gonna have two. I don't have to transfer around as much. I might change my mind. But right now, let's check this out. This is a Singer. Nice looking sewing machine right here. And I bet you this lady, ha I bet you it is nice. Based on the other stuff that she's got. 5050, I don't know. That's a serial number. What's the model number? Seems like it should be right on here. Am I blind? Oh, that's, yeah. I don't know, 621B maybe, or 5050C? Hmm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll look it up, guys. We'll look it up and see if we get a price on it. I don't know. That might be 50 bucks right here. Maybe more. I doubt it. Ah, I don't want any more books. That's okay. Okay, I got the light on. Give us a good, a much better environment back here. Let's go through it back here so I don't have to drag it up. This one is kind of heavy. It's kind of heavy. 
What is this? Smike. Oh, it's a clock. Oh, how cool. Look at you, like, assemble it however you want. It's a clock. That's pretty sweet. Very modern. What's this? Oh, okay, to put your books on, right? Yeah, it's for cookbooks. That's for the kitchen right there. It's got a conversion table built on, and then it folds up. Very cool. Hmm. Okay. Yep. That's what we got here. Whole bunch of cookbooks. Tons of cookbooks. What's this? That's not cookbooks. That's some guitar books right here. Chopin, Peanuts, Christmas Carol, John Thompson's. <laughs> Super Mario's for easy piano. That's funny. Hmm. She has panis. This looks like some nice books right here. It's eight bucks, but um, yeah. Oh, it's just slipping. Okay, guys, I can't get too excited about cookbooks. I'm sorry. I just can't. Um, but they do look like they're kind of nice. So we'll do one of two things. We'll either... Oh, they're just so hard to ship because they're so heavy. I know we get media mail rates on them from the post office, but that just doesn't make it easy. It's still hard to ship heavy stuff. So I'm going to uh, probably just take it to the flea market. Okay? Okay. Albums and cards. So what does that mean, albums? First thing I think I want it to be is vinyl records, right? Those type of albums. Or albums of cards, like baseball cards. But I think it's going to be photo albums. That's the pessimist in me. It says hall closet. That makes me think even more that it's uh, photo albums. But let's see. Um, yeah. I think, I think, I think. Oh, okay, this definitely is. Oh, but these are brand new though. That's nice. So is that. $5 on sale. That's pretty nice. Okay, it looks like these are all leftover Christmas cards that were mailed to them. Let me go through that. Uh, these are really nice little picture books. Ooh, look at that card. I think we have that in one of the other boxes. Is that Sugar Daddies or something? Maybe not. That's nice. Those are really cool. Yeah, that's personal photos. And this one's personal photos. Okay, so we'll get that back to them. Uh, that's another brand new one. Nice. Nice quality. Nice box right there. Sellable. That's a neat box right here. Oh, papyrus. Nice stuff. What is this? Oh, this is heavy. These are like little metal silver star table sprinkles in crate and barrel. Huh, they're heavy. They almost they look like they're magnetic or something. They're sticking together. Twine. These little rocks right here. Little shells. Oh, that is sand. It's more artsy stuff. Crafting stuff. That's cool. Found a bunch of cards here. These are all brand new cards out of those cards, uh, you know, mixed in with the used cards. I'll put those aside. Project Life. Okay, those are pages for a photo album, a huge photo album. Oh, here's the photo album. Project Life, that's 30 bucks. Whoa. Wait, is that photo album? Yeah, okay, that's photo album. It's almost like scrapbooking, though. Hmm. Stetler, that's good pens right there. What's this? Okay, it's some kind of planner. Very nice. Oh, some more brand new cards. Look at that. Friendship. Trader Joe's. Little note cards. It's a neat planner right there. Jeez. A little bit more photos there. Bits and pieces. I don't know what that is. Stickers or something. I think it's for scrapbooking. More photos. 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 Nothing. Scrapbook. Project Life. Project Life. Looks like expensive stuff. Ten bucks there. Six bucks there. It adds up. Your first year. Looks like you have some stickers here. Looks like they're taken out though. Make map art. Project ideas. Hmm. Huh. That's a neat. That's a neat set. And a kids book. Baby book. That's cool. Brand new. My milk tooth. That's funny. This is like those big prints that we found. Milk tooth. I don't know. I think Jana may have put those aside. We had a bunch of numbered ones. Project Life, more of that Project Life stuff. Yes. We'll make a nice lot in our auction with that kind of stuff. Oh my goodness. Tons more. Tons more. Look at that. Five bucks for that. I don't know. It's just seven bucks on that side, but adds up. Nice binders. Photo albums or something. More crafts. More crafts. More crafts. What's that for? I think it's for cutting out. Custom like cutouts. Quilting bee. Crafting books now. Nice. Quilts, 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 quilts. We love quilts. It's good. 
We got more Project Life stuff. Okay, here's this is there's a pattern in here, but I don't think it's here. Well, oh, it is here. Wait, really? That's it? I don't know. I think that's the instruction for the pattern. I don't know. That one's 16 bucks for this pattern right here. See, that's got the pattern in it. This one's missing. That's good. Knitting. Got a bunch of knitting stuff now. It's cool, right? It's good stuff. Okay. Mm, round corners. Okay, that's for making... It's a little punch, right? Punch the corners off. That's cool. Good stuff, guys. Um, and that is it. We already went through that box, except for this. Is this from that? Oh, it is. Okay, but you know what? This is just wood. Oh, those are the slats to go underneath the bed. Okay. We got a ton of furniture in the other locker and also a few boxes. So we're going to still have to go through that. <laughs> it's going to be a pain because I got to pull basically all the furniture out to get to the boxes. And also I got to get the furniture. I got to start selling it. I got to start moving it because it's taking up space. It's clogged up my other unit. So, um, yeah, anyways, uh, good stuff though, right? I mean, lots of crafting. Lots of books, but it is good stuff. It's good quality stuff. Um, so we got to bring it to a better flea market where people appreciate it. Stockton, they just don't appreciate that kind of stuff. Um, they just want to pay you nothing. And really, crafting books, I mean, the books in general barely sell in Stockton. But if we do sell them, they got to be cheap, 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 or else they will not move. And they'll be dumping it at the end of the day. Well, maybe we'll be giving it away. But still, bring it to a better market and give it a shot there first. Uh, that's what we got to do. And that is the De Anza flea market. So if you guys are watching our flea market videos, you've probably seen these two markets that we frequent and know what I'm talking about. De Anza's once a month. Stockton's three times a week, uh, so we go to Stockton more often. It's where we move the volume of the stuff, but the better stuff, and that's what this locker really was, better stuff, goes to De Anza. Uh, we just went there over the weekend and we sold a lot of this stuff, a lot of it, and the crafting stuff went super hot. Not big money, um, but you know what, people were excited and we were, we were pretty busy. I haven't put out the video yet. It'll, I'm weeks behind in videos, but anyways, um, yeah, good stuff. Still a little bit more to go. We'll take a closer look at that furniture and explore the last few boxes. So um, we'll do that in the next episode. All right. Until then, thanks for watching and good luck to you. God bless you. We'll see you next time here on Lock of Nuts. Oh, okay. Yeah. It is really cool. Yeah, it is. It's, yeah. It is. I, you know, I hold them to this thing yeah. forever yeah. and then I got to That's what this is right here. Okay. Now. This uh, I'll give this that to yeah, it's good. this we is gonna do... be another uh, three dollars. These are really.